31. Chapter 31. As the smoke cleared, Ron and Hermione realized the shocking truth. Harry Potter was dead. And in his place stood the beautiful Harriet Potter. The spell had worked. Harry had donned the cloak of transsexuality and now was the young woman he always knew lived inside him. I'm free, Harriet exclaimed. Finally, I'm no longer trapped inside the body of a boy. I'm free to be the real me. Congratulations, said Hermione, smiling. I guess I should have realized all along, she added. You always were a bit of a femme. And this explains why you never tried to bang me, even though I offered up my goblet of fire at every opportunity. I was getting a bit of a complex. I mean, come on, I'm totally hot. Yes, Ron chimed in. And this also explains why you always wanted to wand fight with me in the showers at Hogwarts. He laughed. You always were a bit of a homo, even for a British guy. Well, now what, Harry? Uh, I mean, Harriet, what will you do now? asked Ron. Why, I'm going to play some Quidditch, he, she exclaimed. I've always wanted to ride one of those powerful flying broomsticks the way they should be ridden. They all laughed, and Ron fought back the slight urge he had to vomit. (laughs) 